To be successful in life, Hey mom, can I go see Ella? Nothing is more important than communicating well. That can be a challenge for those with severe hearing loss. At work, I would sometimes not be able to hear, particularly in meetings, and then if I did, it was often I was hearing things incorrectly, which affected my ability to have, build those relationships with my coworkers and also to um, accurately perform my work. Ann Barrow works at the University of Utah as an editor and communications specialist for the Energy and Geoscience Institute. She's married and has two children. At home, before I got the Siemens hearing aids, communicating with my family, particularly my youngest child, was frustrating, I think especially for her. In social situations, I often felt sad or isolated. Having conversations was more difficult, especially in a group, and so I was often um, either left out of the conversations or I myself backed out of them because it was just too challenging. Anne went to Advanced Hearing Center in Salt Lake City and saw audiologist Enoch Cox. Anne's hearing is such that if her kids were talking to her, she might not even know that they were talking. That's why I fit her with the Siemens Nitro. It doesn't whistle, the background noise is, is less, and with this powerful of a hearing aid, that's very rare to find in the industry. Nitro is powered by Siemens Best Sound Technology, featuring advanced microphone directionality hey, hon. that automatically identifies where speech is coming from. You just wear it and it takes up the slack. You walk into a noisy place and it changes. You go into a quiet place and it changes. Gone are the days where you're pushing buttons, moving dials, you just get to enjoy it. I hear so much more of what's going on in my family. I can participate in the joking around and laughing and having fun with them in a way that I couldn't before. Now I have very little fear of not hearing something or hearing it incorrectly. Best of all, I have a great deal more confidence at work.